Hey guys, so in this quick video I'm going to be explaining how you can deal with toxic teammates in Valorant ranked matches or uh, teammates that are just negative overall. So there's a couple different scenarios that can happen from these types of people. Some people might be angry or upset, not necessarily at you, which is actually, it's not a good thing, but it's like better than them being upset at everyone that talks to them. So in this scenario, depending on like how bad they really are or you know like um, how how impactful it is to your gameplay or your teammates gameplay you can just mute them and you can also ask your teammate to mute them um but mainly what you want to do in this scenario is trying to just you don't want to tell them to like you want to tell them to chill but not in like a confrontational way because like it'll probably just make them more upset so you might want to say something like yo we got a bird we got a bird just relax or something like that you know um and by saying that you're basically telling them like we're all in this game together we're a team and I understand that you're upset, but like, let's let's focus up. Like, you could say like, let's focus up, bro. We got this. Have some confidence. You're better than them. Something like that. Um, and so the second type of person is just someone that's really hostile, toxic, mean, rude toward you or your teammates or both, just like anyone. And this is <laughs> it's kind of rare to have both. Uh, usually it's just toward one person, or maybe two. But sometimes you'll have people that are angry toward like literally your whole team for seemingly no reason. Um, truly there is a reason, but you know, it's probably outside of the game that you're currently in. So what you want to do in this scenario is probably mute the person. You can try like once or twice, but don't be as forgiving as the first type of person. Cause the first type of person, they've probably had a, a tough game. And if they aren't mad at you or your teammates, that's, that's fine. Like we all get mad, right? To some extent, but we don't all get mad and we, and, and like rage at our teammates every game, right? Like if you do that, it's, I understand, but like, you know. Um, you, you don't really want to be doing that, especially if you want to be ranking up. So for those types of people, what you can do is try to calm them down once or twice again by saying, yo, we got it, bro. We're your, we're your team. You don't have to be angry at us. We got this. You know, we're going to win. You're better, bro. Have some confidence. Chill out. Take a deep breath. Something like that. And if they, after one or two times you asking them, you can just mute them. And um, if you can ask your teammates to mute them and as well, and then try to just play the game like that. And if, so if you mute them and your team doesn't mute them, this can happen. And then you'll just hear, he'll hear your teammates arguing with the person that you muted. And so the problem with this is it's kind of like the same thing. It's just like excess negative energy that you're kind of like not really filtering out. So if you ask the person to mute them and they're still not muting them, just mute the person that's still talking to them. <laughs> and if there's anyone on your team that wants to actually coordinate and play the game to win, then keep them unmuted and try to talk to them. Even if it's just two of you guys talking, you guys can coordinate play together and it'll be you'll have a higher chance of winning the game and being more effective than if you were to you know keep the other two unmuted and just like deal with the nonsense that they're talking about upset being upset all that you know and if honestly if you're upset what you can do this is just a little added bonus you could just mute your whole team um uh you know this is like not necessarily like a last resort but i wouldn't do this at the start of the game just because like you want to try to be communicative with your team from the get-go but you, you know i understand if it's like not your game and people are just kind of annoying you like they're being like bro what, what are you doing bro like if they're saying some cringe like that and they're just really getting on your nerves then i get it you can just meet up um kind of like try to play your own game but still don't don't just like run it down don't just do like dumb things you know um so that's just like a little added bonus peeping into this church it seems um but yeah guys a short little video hopefully this is useful um, if you guys like these short little videos of content or of information, um, let me know in the comments because I like making these. I'm going to try to make more of these. These take me a little bit longer to come up with ideas, but I'm going to, so I'm not going to be posting like as many of them a day. They don't take very long to record, obviously, but I have to think of kind of like what I want to say, what are good topics, but just let me know if you guys have any ideas and if you want more like this. But anyways, comment, like, subscribe, join my Discord. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.